Greetings in the name of Jesus. Has God put it in your heart to partner with Cherish TV? Have you or a loved one been touched by Cherish Missionary Church? God is using Apostle J.B. and T.E. Makananisa to preach the gospel to the poor, to heal the brokenhearted, to set the captives free, to go into all the world and preach the gospel. When you support Cherish TV, you're uplifting the community, bringing light to a world of darkness, and supporting the work of Jesus Christ. Cherish Missionary Church would like to say, Thank you. Hawala liepa. Thank you. Merci. Herzlichen Dank. Tak sumike. Kasanam. Gerv mahagat. Grazie. Bardzo dziękujemy. Acho. Obrigado. Muchas gracias. Teşekkürler. very long story, extremely short. We were pastors in Michigan for a while uh, at a church of about 100 to 200. Um, we did a lot of community work and God was moving very mightily there. Um, that church, we, we left that church, our house uh, got demolished, I moved on from my job and we pretty much, uh, as I was uh, aspiring and chasing after God, became homeless. And I mean, and my wife is my witness, you know, we slept on the curb, myself and you see my beautiful children, and the whole time we were there, God has never left us. We were in this state for probably about three to four years, so this was not a one-day thing. And God was still speaking and encouraging in light of our situation. We began watching Karis TV probably a year and a half to two years faithfully. Uh, and then just this year, when we first began getting an income, uh, God laid it on our heart that we should start giving to Karis TV. And so we began tithing just in December. Uh, we had just started a small business. I, like I said, we're pastors, uh, but by trade, we know how to do business and marketing and advertising. And so I just started a small business on eBay. Uh, God opened up and gave us a house, a beautiful home. And thank you. So he gave us a house, a beautiful home, all of our bills he paid for. We don't have any debt whatsoever. Uh, and so when we heard that the man of God was coming here, uh, in our hearts we were pricked and we said we have to do anything that's possible to get there. And the first thing that we did was we started to sow seed and to give. Uh, we did not have enough money to make this trip possible by any means. There was a man, a gentleman I talked to last night, and I told him, uh, he said, you know, you guys staying overnight? I said, listen, we don't even have, we didn't even have the money to stay in a hotel, so we slept in our car just to attend this meeting. But this is where the testimony comes from. We started the small business, and to begin, we were making very minimal money in our small business. Very minimal. Um, we sowed a seed and began tithing the carriers uh, TV, and People of God, listen, within three weeks, the profit that we got from our small business went up 300%. And that very day, when we found out, and we didn't know until after we sowed the seed that man of God was coming, we just said, we're gonna sow our seed, we won't be able to make it because we don't have enough money, but we'll connect by faith. I don't know if I should say this next part, but we got an email the first time we sold our seed, uh, our tie to Cares TV. We got an email, I don't know who it came from, uh, but it said, thank you for sowing. Uh, it said, uh, we pray that God uh, lifts you up so that you can bless the ministry. And I looked at my wife and I said, did this come from the man of God, Jamie Mack and Anissa? And my wife was like, maybe. I said, nah, I don't think so. So I wrote back and I just said, is this really Mack and Anissa? And I never got an email. And so uh, we counted down the days and people of God, almost immediately when we began sowing the seed, my wife and I began having new ideas about our business. Doors that were closed blew wide open. And we have so much business now. The, the money that we had 
that we sold is up, our profits are up 300%. Only three weeks from the day we sold that seed, our profits leaped up. We had so much time, we haven't had time to, I mean, to even eat, to sleep. We get up, we get right to business. Money comes in from all over the country. Even as we were sitting here, matter of fact, when we pulled up to the service yesterday, as soon as we pulled into the driveway, my wife can bear witness, our account raised up. We got a sale as soon as we entered into the driveway. While we were here, we got more sales, even then. And so I'm saying this to just testify that we were, and when I say abject poverty, it's hard to believe that being in America, anyone could be homeless. Yes. And we yes. weren't homeless because yes. we couldn't work. We both have degrees in business. Yes. We were very well educated. I used to work for a university. My wife did as well in operations. But when God called us, all those things shut down to get closer to him. And I want to encourage you to say this. Get behind a ministry that God is blessing you in. And bless that ministry. You can only be three weeks away from the greatest blessing in your life. Don't think that what you have is too small. And if you have more room to give, give. Because that seed that you plant today could be the tree that is speaking for your generations tomorrow. Just with that, I just want to thank the man of God, thank his son for their faithfulness, and just say keep watching Paris TV. Amen. Amen. But I just say, let me answer this one. It was like PayPal. Yeah, that's one. Eh? Yeah, that's one. Yeah, I said, let me answer this one. I do know that God is blessing you this week. You know, you're, you're also encouraging me to go and answer all of them. I'm going to answer. Because, you see, I just choose. I said, let me answer this one. So all the people that are sending the money for the ministry, I believe they will start to prosper because of this testimony. I'm going to answer. I'll sit down. Answer. I'll answer. So I won't answer the same way that I answer this one. But your answer is coming to you. In the name of Jesus. Receive you right now. God bless you. Thank you. Amen.